Hi, I'm Steve Kruger. I'm down here in my Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin studio. I'm a watercolorist. And the last Saturday of every month, that'll be the 29th of April this month, I'm going to be teaching a watercolor class at Artisipation Studio and Gallery. The class is from one to four, and it's a lot of fun. It's for beginners all the way up to experienced watercolorists. We'll have everything uh, you need if you're a beginner. If you're a watercolorist, bring your palette and some paper and brushes. Um, it's going to be fun. Again, it's from one to four. So I'm going to be teaching uh, techniques mainly. We're not going to be worrying about color all that much. Um, uh, I like to teach my techniques. It gets you um, interested in watercolor. Uh, it gives you a little confidence if you're a beginner, and it might be something new, uh, new to you, the, these techniques, if you are an experienced watercolorist. So I'm going to show you what I'll be uh, teaching, and uh, again, it's going to be fun. All right, this is going to, we're going to have uh, quarter sheets of inexpensive watercolor uh, paper. You're going to be painting, painting, painting. Uh, I have inexpensive watercolor paper. You're going to be splashing color or uh, paint on here. Uh, this will be the central point that I'm going to draw. This will be drawn out on your uh, inexpensive watercolor paper. And uh, so that way you can practice. Of course, it's a barn. Um, and here we've got, uh, uh, what I liked was this contrast. So again, I, I spent a couple hours just uh, doing these real quick. Um, again, this will be drawn out. And uh, when you're finished toward the last hour, I'll have uh, one of these barns uh, drawn out on a good piece of watercolor paper. And you can take all the things that I've uh, shown you and you can do your own painting. Um, and then hopefully you'll have a nice uh, painting to take home with you. So these are just a few examples. Here's another one. I'll have some drawn out uh, vertically. Um, this is what we'll be working on. You're, you're getting a little um, uh, backwash here and, and getting some uh, an idea that it might be grass or wheat or whatever. Here's another example. And we'll work on trees. Uh, this is what I call the blob tree. You, you put a blob of water and drop in some color and you work the leaves out. You leave some sky holes here as you go. I'll show you how to do uh, tree trunks. And uh, this is with a spray bottle. It gives a little different technique. Um, these are dark. This is kind of a background here. So again, it's gonna be fun. If you're a beginner, I'll have a palette here with limited colors, some greens, uh, yellows. Um, this is blue and brown and uh, a little bit of red in case you want to paint the barn red. So.